guys, it's Queen DJ, and in today's video, I will be reacting to episode 11 of season 2 of Beastars. Let's go ahead and get started in 3, 2, 1, go. There we go. Your girl just did something stupid right now. Okay, so I literally almost rewatched episode 10. And I'm like, because I looked and I saw like the, uh, the, not the orange, the tomato, and I was like, wait, I've seen this. <laughs> So thank God I intervened. I was like, yeah, so where the heck is 11? And I know I downloaded 11, and so I had to make sure. So, yes, thank God. Oh, God, my throat. Are you smelling for what's his face? Is that where Ted was buried? Hmm. Scattering your scales to the wind. Ready for what? Oh, okay. No, don't be. You got this. Are we really about to eat the insects? Oh, shit. Mm -hmm. Yeah. You have to fully commit. Oh, oh, no, no. Swallow it. Is the mouth duty? I mean, it's pretty, but oh. Mm. 
That's food. Okay, never mind, but still food. Isn't that almost like the same thing as killing? From what I've seen in like movies and TV shows and stuff. Like the scene. Being a human ain't easy either. What if that's also what what's his face saw with Tem after he ate him? <laughs> Hell, I would too. <laughs> Oh, here we go again. Hmm? Well, yeah. Yeah, because he hasn't probably been taking his pills. No, he hasn't been looking at her. No. Oh, shit. He scares me. I'm sorry. Like, way too much. Hmm? But yours. Let's hope that doesn't happen then. What you want, Jen? You want wine? Yeah, buddy, Buki, I feel like you're going to use that to, you know, probably kill him, maybe, I don't know. Hmm? Wait. <laughs>
Yes. Seriously? Why the Okay, hold on. Sir, you, you can't just say that. You're a part of this just as much as anybody else. You have to be there and you can't stay here. Really don't say that. I, I mean, <laughs> he only laughed because of the way you look. <laughs> well, in the end, you have to go. You know you're gonna go. We all know you're gonna go. Mm, okay, New Year's Eve. Mm, mm, where you at? No. Well, you're going to have to talk about it, sir. Excuse me. Oh. Oh. Is that a raid in you, huh? Oh, God. Sir, did you just kill Kirito from Sora Online? By tomorrow, you'll probably be a completely different person. <coughs> Excuse me. Haru would probably be sad as well because she loves you. Haru? 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 No. <laughs>
like I'm gonna sneeze again. <laughs> Fucking allergies. Yes. I don't know. I mean, he's been wanting to kill you over something. Mm -hmm. Oh hell no! No 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 no! Cause you might kill him. So what did you do to Peter? This motherfucker really ate Kitty Toe from Sora Online. Oh my god. Are you kidding me? Why? Why? 
Why? Why? Why? Why? Why? What did I deserve for this ending? Are you kidding me? You kidding me? So now I got next week is the finale, right? Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Oh hell no. Nah. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. So Pina, Pina not dead. I thought he would have been okay. That he would have been fine. That no, he wouldn't have gone and ate him. This bachelor has no remorse. Like, really, I need him to go. He need to go next week. He need to die. He need to die. That's it. It's time for him to go. We killing him. We are killing this bear next week. I swear to God. Mm -mm. He got to go. It's time. Pack it up. Get the heck out of this show. It's time for you to go. Get out. Get out. Get out. Get uh, out. Get the fuck out. I'm ready for him to go. I've been ready for him to go. Ever since we found out he was the one who freaking killed Tim. It was time for him to go. You need to go. Get out. Go. I, I swear to God. Oh, ho, 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 ho. To have Pina be built up as a character, a really interesting character, just to get killed off in, like, the second to last episode, possibly, that's a little messed up. And it makes me wonder if he's truly dead. So maybe probably after I'm done watching the next show that I have to watch next, your girl probably gonna look up some spoilers just to really 100% make sure to see... If Pina is freaking dead. But what, out of all the things, I understand, yes, we had to kill him in order to get something into Legacy. Now let's also talk about freaking Louise and his situation with freaking Ibuki. It, it, someone just got shot and my money is on freaking Ibuki. Come on now, because I know Louise always had to have a gun with him no matter what. We know that the only two who were in the car was Louise and Ibuki. And because of the fact is you're going down a long, dark tunnel in the middle of the freaking night, and surrounded by nothing but pitch black darkness, you don't know what is from your front, your back, your left to your right. And so, of course, of course, you're like, you, you know, yeah, I'm going to hide in the darkness, you know. I'm surrounding myself in the darkness. You want to be like Bane from Batman up in this ish. And you're like, mm-hmm, yep, uh-huh, uh-huh, this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to kill you in the darkness. And so something tells me, Ibuki is the one that is dead. He's been wanting to do this for such a long time, the longest time, to the point where he asked his, um, the other guard who was also with freaking, um, with not only Ibuki but also Luis, he said, if there's ever a point, ever a point where I freaking attack our boss and I look at him as a piece of meat, as food, and not as an animal-human hybrid, I need you to shoot me and I need you to shoot to kill and such. This mofo was like, mm, no, this is what I'm going to do. Let's go on a drive, man. Let's go. We're going to go talk a little bit about our feelings. He's going to go into his little, like, backstory, which I'm really nice. I'm really happy they decided to do that because Ibuki has been one of those characters where I was like, damn, what's your business? And I want to know how, what the fuck makes you tick? And to see just a little bit of that, and that's probably the only thing we're going to get because signs is pointing to maybe he's the one who got shot and killed or maybe just shy. I'm glad that they were able to go ahead and do this because 50 out of 50 with some other TV shows and animes that I've seen in the past, when they kind of build up a character for the last few moments of the um, episode, 50 out of 50 that character dies in the next official episode. So it wouldn't really surprise me if he does die in the final episode of this. I need Louise to hurry up and get the F over there because this is going, this fight as of right now is making or breaking the situation of how if legacy is going to be able to see haru again and i need this show to end with those two seeing each other one last time before the show is over because who knows if we're going to possibly get a season three from this show i mean and i'm gonna go ahead and kind of say this because i was gonna wait until we got to the final episode to say this but the season two has been good but i don't think it's on the same bar as season one yes i really enjoyed season one as uh as a whole i loved everything about it the world the lore and everything and i think season two has gone a little more darker and i do like that i have no problems with it i just think the pacing was sometimes like wonky and such it's kind of how i felt with today's horimiya even though i liked the story about it it just didn't seem 
it, it felt out of place to the entire uh, of the, the entire like 11 12 no to uh 13 episodes of Horimiya and with this it feels like because of the fact is we are going back and forth between the school and then also coming out of the school then we went strictly outside of the school and now we're coming back I don't know where this show could possibly go I like I said I would like to see it get a third season because I really truly love these characters but something kind of also tells me that um the an uh, not the anime the, the animation studio who possibly um has made who has made season one and season two maybe doesn't want to do a season three I don't know but they really truly enjoy this show and this series so much because it's their baby and everything but I think they kind of want to go ahead and like end it and possibly move on but we really don't know how in the world this is gonna end until we see this next episode so big hopes for the finale is that yes legacy comes out alive. Um, Riz is the one that dies and that he is able to see anyone else who he killed besides Pina and um, Tem because something tells me he has killed a lot more than just these two and I need him to kind of almost be judged for it in front of any other person well any other person who is currently dead that he has killed and such maybe I'm not 100% sure because they could go this last episode could go any freaking way. I do want to see Legacy Haru and Louise together again one last time and you know Legacy hanging out with Jack and the rest of his friends. Just I want this to end on a really happy note. That's all I really want for the end of this show. That's all. But other than that guys that is my reaction view towards episode 11 of season 2 of Beastars. If you guys enjoyed it please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Matchless Squad and of course I will see you guys either next Tuesday, Wednesday, or Saturday, Sunday for possibly the final episode because I don't know if next week is the final episode. But until then, I will see you guys officially all next time. Bye.